Yo, this is the real Kane Jackson saying what's up. It's May 16th. Just want to send a shout out to all the fans, friends, everyone who listening. I'm pretty sure my name, you know, the real Kane Jackson. It's all over the internet, all over the United States. So I'm giving it to you live and direct. Uh, this is what's really going on. As you know, the government choose in to this station. So this is just a podcast. I've given everyone a summary of events that's been going on. Like I said, for the record, I don't have anything against the government. I'm not anti-government or anything like that. Some politicians are pretty cool that I know. Uh, let me do a couple name drops, like Senator Purdue over there in Georgia. You know, another senator in Alabama, Senator Shelby. You know, he's pretty cool. There's another senator down south in Georgia. Um, I forgot his name. But like I said, some of the senators and some of the congressmen, those guys are pretty cool. But unfortunately, you know, some of those politicians, you know, if you don't do exactly what they say or what they want you to do, you know, you should get blacklisted and banned. So this is uh, another round telling the podcast and the people what's really going on. So as you know, as of today in a couple of days from now maybe a few weeks from now who knows i've been blacklisted and banned but i'm still making money so i'm getting ready to um head overseas soon so to all the people that fuck with me fuck with me and head overseas but uh how i got on this list start speaking the truth you know giving out some information and some people in the very high places, including the Illuminati, you know, that's over the government, the shadow government, including 44 and Jay-Z, you know, they check in into this station. Like I said, obviously they didn't like some of my music and some of the things that I posted, so they blacklisted and banned me. But it's cool because the light is at the end of the tunnel. So, and as far as the music, I, um, because I didn't fuck someone in the ass, or I didn't agree to get fucked in the ass, this is the result. So, you know, they try to force this mental illusion, confusion, and force you to be mentally unstable, which is definitely not the case. I'm nowhere near that. I just try to stay to myself. And, you know, try to, you know, stay a positive outlook. Now, I didn't know that, you know, the government or whoever had this much power where they can actually close down your show, blacklist and ban you just about almost worldwide. So, but it's cool. It's a learning experience. And like I said, I'm getting ready to... uh Everything is looking pretty good now, so the spirits is high. So I'm definitely dating now. So to all the women out there, when I say I'm looking for a young woman, that means someone who's 25 and older. So I'm not looking for no old lady who can't have a baby. So nothing against the old ladies, but I'm looking to date and have more kids. So unfortunately, you have the LGBT community, you know, they also check my page. I'm not homophobic. I don't have anything against them. I just ain't into that fucking dudes in the ass and ain't nobody fucking being the ass. I'd rather have a woman, have kids, and we do our thing, whatever we do. It's our business. So that goes out to the gay community. Sometimes when gay people, even those in government, you know, Jay Z and some other people, you know, because if you don't sleep with them, fuck them, and they don't fuck you, you know, what you see is the result of being blacklisted and banned in America, even in London, because I refuse to get down with the get down with 44 and Jay-Z. So that's the real story. So in order to paint me as a bad person and to de- defend my character, defame my character, slander, 
I try to say I'm crazy, mentally uneasy, uh, terrorist, and all that other stuff. You know, AIDS, HIV, rape kids. No, I'm not into none of that stuff. So actually, I go to church and everything else, but it's just a force of the Illuminati to try to take a black man down. But I'm not sure how or why I got on that list. The only thing I can do is stay positive and move forward. So my time is coming. So ladies, if you out there like what you see, let's have that baby. It's gonna be a Malcolm X, Martin Luther King, Asley Brothers, Bob Marley, all rolled up into one. Respect.